This is St Martin's Primary School telling you about the past, present and future of the cattle market. Watch and learn. The origins of Hereford markets date back over 12 centuries. By the end of the 10th century, Hereford, an important Saxon centre, was holding regular markets close to the modern cathedral cliffs. After the Norman invasion in 1066, a new marketplace was formed. By the late 17th century, Hereford was overcrowded and filthy. Lack of sanitation led to typhoid and cholera. In 1809, a public meeting was held to consider moving the sprawl of the street stores into one place. As a result, by 1860, a butter and poultry market was opened. In 1856, Hereford's new cattle market opened with better provision to hold livestock markets. This is the area that's now been demolished. The old one was built in the, the 19, late 50s, early 60s, and as, as markets go, there was nothing really wrong with it, other than its position. You know, there were things that could have been improved, but if, if somebody had said, you've got to take the old market with you and come out here, I wouldn't, it wouldn't have been the end of the world. There was a big cattle ring, there was a big cattle penning area, and there was a lot of sheep penning. Queen visited in 1957. She stood on the way bridge. Suddenly, everybody knew her weight. The biggest handicap of the old one was where it was. It was the parking, the access, the unloading. It was all crammed in a traffic chaos. How long has this site been here? We came here on the 22nd of June 2011, so we're coming up for two years. You went to both sites? Yes, how do they compare? They're sort of a bit like a very, very old car and a very new Rolls Royce. How many animals do you have in the day? Up to 8,000 sheep, and there would be 500 to 600 cattle. That's the maximum we've had up to now. Maybe one or three. 46 an army now. One or two. Two bit, two bit, one bit. Three bit, three bit, three bit, three bit, three bit. Four with a four with a four. Half, four with a four. Three, half, six, half. One six and a half. And the numbers that you're calling out, is that for one sheep or is that for all that you can see? That's one. That is one. Um, <clears throat> The chap next to me gives me a weight, say 43 kilos, and then you've got to judge then as quickly as possible how, how good it, uh, it all boils down to the meat on its back. I think the day we opened the champion, the champion animal was just over 3,000 pounds. 